Every difference is Netflix BT6. Have you ever played balloons when the Wi Fi was out or when you were out somewhere and didn't have any of it? With the phone version, you can do that easily and removes any need for data waste or guessing Wi Fi passwords. But on the Netflix version, this is not possible as it requires you to log into your Netflix account and have it logged in the entirety of the time. But have you ever desperately needed monkey money and searched up a guy for it on YouTube and failed even though you were using the guy? Well, this is not needed on the Netflix version as you can get an extra 50% of monkey money on there and sometimes even more which means that you can just play and out of nowhere you can have a lot of monkey money i'm sure you absolutely despise the people that use the double cash mode and that's very much good to do but in bt6 netflix those people cannot exist as a shop isn't in the game which makes people actually have to grind for what they want uh so hard it's actually easy you might want to use this version to pay on your normal account and get over the extra monkey money but netflix has already thought of this and they only let you play using your netflix account and nothing else if you're playing co-op you have a randomly generated censored name but in challenges and any other stuff like that you can have your own netflix username which means that you can name yourself poopy fast man let's go the updates are the best part of bt6 you get back home open the game just see a new update wait for it download and play the beats handler just to realize that it isn't that fun but the beginning part is what matters on bt6 netflix that process is not the same you see people that have gotten the update but you gotta wait a day or two to be able to get it 